How underscore future underscore imports work under the hood? I've been fascinated by the underscore future underscore module, in particular, its ability to change the way statements are parsed in Python. What's most interesting is how doing something like enables you to use print and not print underscore function, like you would expect any other normal import to do. I have read what is underscore future underscore in Python used for and how slash when to use it, and how it works thoroughly and in particular came across a particular line. A future statement is a directive to the compiler that a particular module should be compiled using syntax or semantics that will be available in a specified future release of Python. I would love to know the intricacies of what exactly makes this possible. In particular, how something like can enable true division on Python 2, while can enable the is lower than dot 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 is greater than syntax on Python 3. What I find most funny is that you have to import a feature from underscore future underscore for backward compatibility. Anyway, to summarize, I would like to know how the directive is understood and executed by the compiler when underscore future underscore or its artifacts are imported. From underscore future underscore import print underscore function tells the parser to not treat print as a keyword, leaving it as a name instead. That way the compiler treats it as the function and not a statement. To track this, the compiler struct has a C underscore future field that holds a pi future features object that tracks which future directives have been enabled. Various parts of the parser and compiler check the flags and alter behavior. This is mostly handled in the future.c source file, which has a future underscore parse function that checks for import from asked objects with the module parameters set to underscore future underscore, and sets flags based on what is found. For example, for the berry underscore as underscore fluful feature, the parser refuses not equal as syntax but accepts is lower than dot 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 is greater than instead. You can find the other examples by grepping for the future underscore flags listed in compile.h. Note that there is a underscore future underscore python module, but it is not directly involved in the parsing and compilation of code, it is merely there to give python code easy access to metadata about directives, including bitfield values to pass to the flags argument of the compile function, nothing more. If you like to support the channel, please consider subscribing.